Hey guys, I'm Alec and Dinchia. welcome back to my Pokemon Soul Silver Nuzlocke like Challenge. The last episode, I did some grinding and I added Kiss to my team and got it fully evolved. Uh, so now it's an awesome Tyranitar and Kiss is holding something apparently, so let's take the item. And, and I know like when you um, walk around your Pokemon, your Pokemon do pick up items. But Yellow Flower, I think it's mostly, or I think it's all the time, just stuff you can buy in your fashion case. It's not too useful, it can be somewhat useful. But anyway, last episode I did mention that I was going to do the legendaries this episode. But, before I do that, I've been meaning to do this for quite some time now, I just keep forgetting, and that is get a seals case, and to do that I'm going to need some Oran Berries. But, unfortunately I don't have any, so I have a blue shard. And what do you do with this person here in Violet City is you give him uh, certain shards and he'll give you certain, like, berries for it. So I have one blue shard, so he gives me an Oran Berry. And now this isn't enough to get me the, um... And get me the uh, the seal case, but what I can do is sort of uh, I, I don't know how to call it, how to put it, but I can sort of grow the berries in berry pots. I think I have them. Not too sure though. Um, honestly, I've never used these at all in my life, so it's kind of a new thing to me. But uh, I think you've got you've got to do some steps or something to make it, um, make the berries grow into more berries. I think it's just growing berries and stuff. It's like, kind of like in the, uh, Hoenn games where you could, uh, the, them grow around in certain areas of the region, except you can't carry this around with you. So, I'm actually gonna go to Golden Run City, because I know you can buy mulch, mul I can't even pronounce the word, but it's basically just stuff you can put in the berry pots to, um, sort of, it just basically speed up the growth of the Berries, and then I am now going to be able to get the uh, unformed berries to get the seal case. And you might be wondering why I need orange berries, and that is because uh, you get them from the mill tank person. You get um, basically there's a sick mill tank, and you give them orange berries, and they reward you with the seals case. Um, so that's how you get that. Uh, yeah, we can buy some mulch. M mulch is mulch, not I don't know why I put an N in it, but uh, it's mulch. Uh, it ups the number of times new plants grow where uh, your plants are withered. Um, right, I'll buy some growth mulch. Uh, so yeah, I think you've occasionally got to water them. I'll probably do some walking around off screen if it does require walking around. It probably does, I can't understand it not doing. So, um, can we open it? Use. Gosh, I've never used this before. So, we can fertilize the first one. Okay, so there's apparently there's five different pots, and we can do, you can have several berries growing in each of them. That's, that's useful. You can have several of the go at once. So, let's put the uh, mulch in, and the first one, because I only have one orange berry at the time, this time. Uh, so, we'll plant berry, and plant the orange berry. The reason I had to trade the shard for the berries is because I didn't actually have any orange berries before. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to be doing some running around and some research on this. Uh, yeah, I think you can also water it. Uh, yeah, but I'll be right back when I have some more berries. Okay, I missed. I cheated. Because uh, I looked it up on the internet, and I found that it takes um, time for the berries to grow, like real life time, and not game steps. Game steps don't affect it. So, I changed my time back and forth and back and forth on my computer. Uh, to allow myself to get some more berries, so right now I have. Um, let's go find my berry pocket. I have 11 more berries, so yeah. I think we only need 10, and I'm, I'm pretty sure I've already given about um, about three-ish, three-ish or something to the girl. But um, yeah, I, I wasn't gonna wait for like several days to be able to actually do this, so. Hope you don't mind that I change the time, so I'm gonna meet you back at the place where I get the um, the berry, the uh, seal case from where I give them the berries, and that emulator just let you. I'm sorry about that. Okay, now I'm here, and um, yeah, this is a little farm place with all the mill tank. I believe the mill tanks only come out during the day. Oh, I'm, yeah, I'm pretty sure there are mill tanks around here in the day. We've seen them before. But anyway, let's go in here, uh, where the mill tanks actually are, rather than outside, because it's night time now, which is a cool little thing they thought about to implement the game. But anyway, we've seen this poor little mill tank before. 
It's weak. Oh, so yeah, we've got to give it several arm barriers. I think it's 10 if you haven't given any to it before, but I'm pretty sure I've given it three, so this is the second one. I'm probably going to give it about seven, and then it should be okay. Then we can get our seals case, and then we can move into legendary. So is that three or four? Oh gosh, I lost count, but whatever. Uh, so yeah, keep on giving the orange berries. Then I'm pretty sure the girls give it yeah, or do the uh, parents in the farm give it yeah? I, I know it gives you access to Moo Moo, Moo Milk as well. Uh, so that is another thing because they're much better than potions. So the time we can totally healthy. Uh, so you're gonna give me uh, my seal case. Um, okay, so yeah, the other side is we can get a seal case from her. And the reason I want a seal case is because I find it pretty awesome to customize your Pokeballs. And since now, I'm not, probably not going to change my team around because now everyone's level 70, which I didn't mention. Because I grinded up everyone to level 70. Uh, I, I feel like it's a cool thing to have seals on my Pokeballs, as well as wanting to show off all the features. That's kind of what I've tried to do throughout this Let's Play. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, so you can get a whole bunch of stuff, which is like, amazing. I think it's just the moo milk, milk we can get from here. Uh, we can buy a dozen. We can buy 12. Oh! <laughs> we don't have enough money. Wow, that sucks. My mum's stealing all the money. So we get TM83 as well from healing up the... Um, healing up the mill tank. So... What that does is basically it just move depends on what berry you're holding and it does more damage if you get a better berry or whatever. So now I'm actually going to go down to Olivine City and just you do the seals. I think we can also get another seal uh, down in Olivine City. You can get them every day from a girl in the house which is a pretty awesome thing. But you can only get the seals once you've got the seal case because you need somewhere to put them of course which is a difficult thing and if you aren't at the point of the game where you have blue shards or any sort of ore and berries to sort of, um to uh yeah we can have some seals here how grateful is she though that she's given the seals that sister give give her to us so yeah if you're early on in the game and you don't have any ore and berries to grow and you can't grow them or whatever the whatever reason you can't do what i did then what I did in my original Soul Silver game, I went to the department store on Wednesdays in Goldenmont City, and there you can actually win ore and berries at the top floor in the um, prize draw. So third prize on Wednesday, so it's kind of difficult to get, and you spend so much money trying to do it. But you, what you can do is just save and reset the game if you don't get enough ore and berries, and um, yeah, it should be it's a good idea, I suppose, because I I found it very useful to do that. It's very tedious, but it does work. So now we're gonna go and set the seals. I'm already on eight minutes. Oh my god. I need to hurry it a heck up because I need to do the legendaries. But I'm probably gonna only do a couple ones this episode and I'll do the other ones the next episode. I've gone into the wrong one. So we need to go and do and choose PC, I think, do we? Yeah, and choose PC and then got ball capsules. And let's do the first one. We can oh, this is interesting. We can have some stars. Um we put the stars for Espeon. Let's make this Espeon's one then. Star. Party seal. I think party seals are confetti. So what I have at the moment are star seals, fire seals, petal seals, and um, confetti seals, and the music seals. So I'm going to put a confetti and a star for Espeon because I don't have too many seals at the moment. I mean, you can get all the seals, get so many seals. I'll put a bunch on one Pokeball if you want to. Uh, later on in the game. I might come back here a couple times and um, actually and do, do, do get some more seals and all that sort of stuff. So the next one should be um, who should I do next? I'm just trying to think. Let's go for Lantern. And uh, what should I give Lantern? I mean I have I don't have too many seals left. I want to be as sparse as I can be. Um, let's. I'm probably. I'm probably should take a little pause again. Figure this out because I'm. I'm. I'm getting quite long into this episode. I haven't done anything yet, so I'll be right back and I'll get all my capsules set up and I can show them off afterwards. Okay, now set them all to each of my Pokemon. And what I did mention was that um, should be there. I just forgot to mention was that basically if you don't know what seals are, you probably 
totally confused now. What the seals are are basically fancy things that make come out of your Pokeball when you throw out your Pokemon. And once you set the seals or the seal capsules to each of your Pokemon uh, in your team, you can't actually put them in the computer box, which is a little bit annoying. But since I'm not going to be changing my team and hopefully my team won't die, I mean, like, like I said before, level 70, it should be okay with that. So I'm actually going to skip ahead to your random wild battles and show off all the seals on my Pokemon. Okay, hey guys, sorry for skipping right into the middle of the battle here. And what I figured out is that the seals don't work when entering the battle, they don't appear. And for Charizard, they don't seem to appear at all. I mean, I've set the seals, but they don't seem to appear. It's really weird. I can only get a couple of them to work. So I'm going to show you just what I can, um, what does work. So let's shift down to Naka. Uh, the seals only show when you switch Pokemon, which is kind of strange. But yeah, Naka's got the stars and the confetti. And I'll switch out into... Okay, I could try Charizard, but Charizard for some reason just doesn't work. The seals doesn't try. I had fire seals on Charizard, because it is a fire type, and it just didn't seem to work. I, don't, I have no idea why. I mean, if you guys can tell me why that is, then please do, but there's nothing. The seal's definitely set to Charizard, and I don't know. Just a weird thing. This Meowth is getting annoying. I'll probably speed up this little part here. But yeah, I did have, actually have my kiss, kiss out before. That's why there's a sun stomach, if you're wondering. So, kiss now. And I, I think there was a little bit of, like, fire, or you could call it fire at the bottom. Um, speeded that up. I'm sorry about the random speeding here that I just want to show you. We got petals for Barry here. Uh, who have a nice show. I should have spun some orders of this. Let's try Electro now. Electro has musical notes and confetti. Uh, Meowth Meow wasn't a good Pokemon to go against because the Fury Swipes are not particularly um, fast to deal with. So uh, that was the confetti and petals there. I think that's everyone. Is that everyone now? I don't even know. Is it? Did I show, yeah, I showed Kiss. I, yeah, I'm pretty sure I've still shown everyone now. So yeah, I'll just run from this battle because there's no point. And I will meet you guys back where I'm meant to be battling the legendaries. Okay, I'm sorry about all the cutting and the editing and uh, rambling in this episode. So I do want to say I am uh, sorry about that. And I'm actually not going to do legendaries in this episode because I've just gone on about steals for so long and it's a bit disjointed. I would rather separate them into like, this is a short episode and do the legendaries next two episodes. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to hold off legendaries for a little bit, but I will be trying to get more of these uploaded. So in a summary to the seals, because I can't even remember what I'm going to cut out and what I'm not going to cut out, because I had so much failures in this episode, so many, like, why did things work? Because I've never done them, um, never done the berry thing before, and the seals just, for some reason, doesn't work on Charizard. So, uh, yeah, the seals, basically you want to get 10 orange berries either from the department store on Wednesdays, uh, get the third prize, it's going to take a while to do, but you can do it from re saving and restarting your game, or you can get an orange berry from your mum if you let her save you money, or just a random trainer, and you're probably gonna, not going to get enough from that, so you can put them into the berry pots, which is the third one, and if you don't have enough orange berries, put them into berry pots. And grow berries, which grow over several days, is very tedious to do. That's why the seals are so difficult to get. But I've done it, and uh, I want to say thank you for watching. Next time we will be moving on to the legendaries. I know I've been saying that so much, but we will be doing. I think next episode is going to be um, the uh, Moltres, um, Suicune, Zapdos, and Latios. So they're the sort of the easier ones to get to. And then after that, I'll probably do the Articuno and Mewtwo because they're a little bit harder to get through because they're in big cave systems and stuff. I know I said I wasn't going to do Mewtwo straight away, but I've decided to just split into those two episodes. And I think it's much more sense to do that. And if, like, say, they don't all fit into the first one, I will sort of split them and um, share them more between the two of them. And unfortunately, I'm going to have to kill them all because it's a Nuzlocke. Uh, so, yeah. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.